Good morning, welcome to Beacon Church Online. I, my name's Dave and I'm just going to do a little introduction to what we've got this morning. Uh, so we've got two parts this morning with regards to Helen, who's chosen some songs for us this morning, is going to do us a little worship intro. Um, and then after Helen, we've got Matt, who is preaching on the victory is the Lord's, which is a real encouragement. And then after that, it's actually me doing kids work. So I apologise for that, but hopefully that'll be fun. Um, but I also want to plug as well this morning. So today's Sunday. So Sunday morning today at 11 o'clock, there's also a live kids work Zoom. So if you're interested in that, I'll put a link in the bottom uh, with the details um, of what you can do to come and access that. Um, but you, basically, you should have got an email on Beacon Essentials for the, all the parents. But if, you, if you're if unsure and haven't got the details, you, send me, you can send me an email or you can send Meg an email or any of us some email and just ask for the details because we'd love you to come and join us so we can see some people's faces live the kids work so that'd be really good so i really just want to plug as nathan did last week our alpha which is starting it's starting on wednesday the 10th of february this is a really good opportunity to invite people along this is an opportunity that perhaps we haven't had before because alpha was always a face-to-face thing but because it's online you can invite someone from much further afield i want to encourage you to think about it think you know you might have been thinking in the past of like oh could i invite my neighbor or my colleague who i work with well actually you could ask someone much further afield and i want to say that this is a really positive thing um you know there's lots of challenges from the situation we're currently in but this is a situ- this is something where we can actually do something a little bit outside of the box and i really want to encourage you if you if you're keen to try alpha um you can go now on our website and now there's a page and there's a link you put in your details and just say that you want to try alpha and this that's what we want to encourage people to do just to come and try it that's that's what it is it's not we're not we're not looking for you to make a commitment or anything we just want you to come along try it see how it goes and it, I, we just think it's really positive and it's and you know this is something that we're doing as a church um, but if you see this and think actually I'm really interested again I'm going to put a link in the description here of, of to that page you can say look I want to do that I want to try alpha Due to the current circumstances, it has to be online, it has to be Zoom, we can't meet face to face, which would obviously be great. Now, I want to talk about that a little bit. I, I, you may or may not know that the church, obviously, as I just said, we have a website. We also have a Facebook page. We also have an Instagram uh, account as well, which puts information up there. Now, um, if you look at what Nathan was talking about last week in doing the work of evangelists. Now, um, if you look at the way the early church started, they communicated in the way they could, which was often with letters or else they spoke word of mouth. Now, we live in a world now that there is so many different ways to communicate with people. And I just want to encourage you, we, we can use social media, which you may sit there and think, oh, I don't like it. I don't like all these things. But actually, I just want to encourage you that actually it, it can be a negative thing, but it actually can be something that is really good and positive. Um, so I want to encourage you that we have, our, uh, as I say, we've got a Facebook page. Now. I want to encourage you, you can share things or like them. It's just liking. Now, the, the thing about social media is the whole point of it is to like, because the idea is it shows you other people show, who you are friends with. It will show you what you like and it will then show them th- perhaps things that the church thing, um, have posted, which could be an encouragement. And you get to the opportunity to do the work of an evangelist. You could send somebody something that has just been posted that might just be an encouragement to them. So I really want to encourage you. I'm going to put links. I'm going to point down here because they'll be down in the description for this video. Um, there'll be a link to our Facebook page, uh, a link to our um Instagram and a link to our website as well and we're going to we're going to be actively trying to put a lot more information up there for you uh, and try and be a little bit more so that there's more things for you to share because we realize that actually especially in the world we're currently in where we a lot of our life is online that we can make the most of this we can take over this media and actually supply good wholesome encouraging stuff to people from the church so i hope you'll get on board with that and i hope i'm gonna i'm gonna make the one of the things i do is i do some of our social media stuff so i'm gonna make an effort to put lots of things on there for you to to um, make available and but i would encourage you if if you're interested if you think hey do you know what i'd like to create something it creates some sort of creative content i want i've been really encouraged by the creativity that people have shown during lockdown whether it's um video creation anything we've done so i want to say if you can think of anything you would like to do get in contact with me um, I'd love to hear about it and we can share things that are going on because I, I think it's good to be able to share whether it's testimonies whether it's uh, videos about ministries and things that are going on it'd be really good to share this sort of thing online with not only just the church but the wider community as well so I hope you're going to really enjoy it this morning and I pray that God will be with you and that I pray that you can just focus so Lord we just thank you that 
through technology, Lord, we can still meet together, Lord. There's so many ways that we can, um, we don't have to be isolated in this, what is a lockdown, Lord. I thank you for that, Lord. I pray that you help us just to fix our eyes on you this morning, Lord, uh, that though there are so many distractions and things going on, that we can just stop, take a pause and fix our eyes on you. Amen.